Fred Locks, what's going brother, brother? My knife no blow out. Zane. Ah, man, so good to hear your voice, my brethren. Well, yeah, man, I never know what I do to that for sound chat. I never know what I do that. <laughs> <laughs> you're, you're, you're doing so much dub plate these days that you don't even you can't even keep a track of them, don't it? I just did about four today too. You just did about four. Um, yes, before, in before, we, before we get into the conversation, um, Cherry Rock and I were just having a side conversation while we were making phone connection about the fact that um, you know, you became you know, over time, one of those sound systems, one of those um, artists, foundation artists that sound systems wanted to get their hands on on dub plays just to say, me have that Fred Locks here. You know what I mean? When we're speaking about foundation music and Rasta sure. music, you know what I mean? Yeah. It's like... The real deal. Yeah you, you, yeah, you would say, you know, you would... You, you would the, your music is one of the, the selections in which a sound man would find himself being challenged. I bet you can't play a Fred Locks. And, and that says a lot when somebody's using your music to, to kind of dare someone else, you know, to play. Yeah, I bet you can't find a Fred Locks selection. Yeah. Never counteract my own special them. Guess what? I got the man himself on the phone live from Kingston, Jamaica. Seven seconds and a sound gets louder. Dump the me in the arbor. <laughs> <laughs> I wear that. I next song come and say, I'm upset in my machine. Seven seconds can't kill for me, Sonia. <laughs> you know, how, how do you enjoy the dub play culture before we go to where it started from you? How do you enjoy that? The fact that you people know, are knocking you know, on the door? Well, let me tell you this now. I don't play it, I live off of because I go ask you the man, I say, Fredo, when you do all style and them things, they never get no money. I say, no, World Pirate came and rabbi. So I eat more, <laughs> eat more food off a special for my children when I do a long time. Like, I'm very in demand when it comes to special, as I say. It is so crazy. And so I'm telling you, I'm the wickedest intro, them, you know? I don't know if you remember that first time being in a dub plate studio. Do you remember that? Yeah, man. I want to tell you, say, Chin, Mr. Bourne, the first man I ever do a, a, a dub for in New York, when they have Agony, King Agony. Say, say it again. Say it again. Say, Mr. Chin, the first man to <laughs> give me a dub plate for doing that, but what life? For those of you who are sound men and, and, and you're listening, I would like you to hear what Uncle Fred just said. Yeah, I man. was the first person to get him into a dub plate studio to do a dub plate. When I voiced Fred, he had no clue of what dub plate culture was. Him yeah, just, you know just through the 12 tribe link and the mm. link, him say, all right, let me, 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 me straighten the youth. Them. I just want to say on the want, all right, let me, me help you out and give you that selection. Yeah. Yeah, man, Stephen, them, man. Yes, you know, I. Peace, yes, them, man. I. Yes, I. I remember them days. <laughs> and, and, and then it just evolved into, you know, Agony playing you on dub and other songs playing you on dub as well. Yeah, and no, no, you just dub request it. And you answer a Japanese call me after them, you're dubbing out on a Dan one. Then. Yeah. And a big food, I get to it, you know. <laughs> <laughs> so, you know, the thing I go, ah, la, 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 la. Yeah, but give thanks, man, because right now, I dub around the thing and show it on the virtual and them things, indoors, and you know the thing. So, people are calling me hard, I say, bro, I have some wicked intro, you know. I intro them alone, kill sound, you know. Wow. Wow. I do an intro, I don't know if I can talk, I say, hey, sound boy, you're full of HIT more than a pit toilet, and when the girl from me, she have to name it. The man said that they use and kill the sound in Europe. <laughs> so it, 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 let's take it back to the beginning, Fred Locks. Let's take it yeah. back before dub play. Let's take it back to, you know, the spiritual realms. Let's take it back to yeah, why right, you became there. an artist. Let's talk about that. When, when, right. when did you start to record? All right, here it is now. Me, me, me grew up with a father who is a guitarist and a mother who can sing very well. So, at about eight years old, my father used to come in a bar to sing, and them friends them give money. Mm -hmm. Same way, I play them guitar, I sing from Nat King Cole and them things. See? And all of them top artists there. So, when I reached 17 years old, my father looked for me and said, what do you want to be when you grow up? I said, I can play football good, but them call sack and I can sing. him. So which one you prefer? I said, singing. I said, well, if, you do, if you're doing what you love and love what you're doing, you will excel. And I record my first song for studio one, I was releasing a flag group named The Lyrics. I do it supposed to do them things. There's some little boy about all that. I be singing old man say, and the rhythm where Bob and they sing Desperate Love Up. And my song create the rhythm there. My song is yeah, Music Like Dirt. So from that 17 year old, I record my first song. 
So you rec- After five you, songs. You recorded at 17 for Studio One. Right. Who was at Studio One when you were 17 years old and trying to become a part of the industry? The great man, Delroy Wilson, Alton Ellis, Slim Smith, Ken Booth. When I go up there, I see them, man, they feel like a fish out of water. And they say, Yo, sing, what, what are you doing? Sing some tune, my career, man. And if they pass you, Cox, they pass you, too, you know. So the world always sit down, Heptones, everybody, and they sing them tune, and we sing, and they say, You, you're bad, man. I'm the best from the East. Them, you, you're bad, because above you will come from, you know, so. I'm saying, I'm tough, man. In, yeah. in those times, Fred, were you were you Fred Locks at the time or were you going by no. a different name? We just had the group the name the lyrics. I was the lead singer for the lyrics. Mm-hmm. Then and uh, Fred Locks was a name that uh, I heard or that combo. <laughs> one day, one Sunday, we were over a place out of Bullby, I sing. You know, you know, you know, we used to be like a caretaker for a, a, a theater name, a Rambe. So I formed a group. My cousin, wife, and the next was on me, I sing. I said, Tony and the Melon College. See? It? So me I sing, There's a spark of magic in your eyes. Candlelight of fears each time you smile. So some you come from over some friends and say, I some last time sing so when you group him. Mm-hmm. Me said, Tony and the Melon College, I use name Shanty say, that's all like from Pogat. <laughs> 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 so we decided to call myself, he said, we don't want a Rasta name. So I said, I call myself Fred Locks, because I climbed with Dreadlocks. And that is all. From 1973, that. And me, make the name of myself. So I call myself Fred Locks, you know? So let's, let's go back to the Nat King Cole days, right? Before you started yeah. to, to, to record and sing original songs. What were your popular Nat King Cole songs that you were singing at the time? I was singing Mona Lisa and them songs there. Because my father used to have him, him, him guitar book with the, with the, the notes in there. And the words written between them, so I put it down on a plate and say, sing. But I, I, mean, look, I, was, I must tell you, I was very bright. So I could have just look on the words them and read them. And I and may sing them while I play the changes. And I was singing uh, some Frank Sinatra and them things like, I did it my way. Um, Benny King sang them, Stand By Me. And you know them classic, the, this magic moment, uh, you know. Wait, so wait, which songs. one of those songs was your favorite, Fred? Well, 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 not King Cole song, um, the same song I was telling you about, I know a long time, Mona Lisa. Mona Lisa from not King Cole. And I, I used to love singing some Bing Crosby. And, you know, Drifters, Drifters, what about Drifters? When Drifters come from the scene, like, there's no Drifters that I didn't know I couldn't sing, you know? I, I, so, can, I can imagine that people are listening to our conversation right now and saying that they would love to hear Fred Locks go back in those days. <laughs> So I'm going to yeah, ask man. you to sing one of those songs that you sung as a 17, 18-year-old boy before we move forward. I uh, m- record this song recently, a platter song. Every shades of night are falling, it's twilight time. Out of the mist your voice is calling, it's twilight time. When purple-colored curtains mark the end of day, I hear you, my dear, at twilight time. Deeper in shadows gather splendor as day is done. Moment of light will soon surrender the setting sun. I count the moments there until you're home again. Together at last at twilight time. Get the bridge now. Here. In the afterglow of day, we'll keep our rendezvous beneath the blue air. In that sweet and same old way, I'll fall in love again as I did then. Deep in my heart, your kisses thrills me like days of old. Lighting the sparks of love that fills me with dreams untold. Each day I pray for an evening just to be with you together at last at twilight time. I know. <laughs> yeah, I'm a wicked hour. <laughs> <laughs> Those of you who just no, locked sir. in, we are talking to Fred Locks. Turn up your I radios that, loud. We think that the p- p- computer part and the man chin has them, so I for record that. No. See. I'm doing it in a reggae and it's going good. Swinton Lindsay said got number two on them chart and it played 15 times one day in New Jersey. And so now go on. When we speak, well, well, Fred, when we, when we say we're going to 
do an interview and we're going to pay homage to, to, to artists who have done work like you. We're going to make sure that we fully equipped with the music so people can follow the conversation, my brethren. Yeah, go on, go on. I tell the truth. I love that. You're at Studio One. 18 years old, all of the greats are there. You're, you, 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 you know, you're around the big ones, and you're, you're feeling a little intimidated. Who is that special artist to you in that crop of artists at Studio One that gives you a hand and you know mentors you to the next stage? The boss himself, Alton Ellis. Jeez! Alton Ellis, you you can sing, man. Don't make nobody intimidate you. Just sing. <laughs> what, what was that relationship with you, you know, and Alton like? It's, a, it's like from a meeting, and just give, and, and encourage me. Sometimes I go up to the one and see me, just salute him. And he say, yes, my youth, you know. And then we get close to Gaylord and, um, and, and Ken Booth. After a while, I just want my band name, Swinging King. Mm -hmm. And I used to do some, some, some Kingston run. And even come to my era, Arborview. So, you know, we get close to them, because I'm waiting for me come as a youth. So, they all come, Arborview come look for me and all. And them go, your child up by eight miles and them, you know. <laughs> so, so were there other young, young, youngsters get trying to get in as well, or you were the only younger one, young one at? Well, I must tell you, so when I got there, um, I was one of the youngest person, but the man in my group was much older than me. And unfortunately, the two men I used to sing, one, one, is, one is going to be buried the 29th in Florida. He was like three, four years older than me. Danny Campbell, God, God rest him soul, and the next one, Albert Tomlinson, do some wicked tune as studio one too. Mm -hmm. Them man, there was older man. So with me go as a youth, but them say, yo, you for just sing lead, because I don't know nothing about harmony, you know. But, <laughs> but me, I write some good tunes, so them say, sing your tune them. So most of the tune them, I was writing them, so they make me the lead singer. So, and then, so most of know? the early songs were originally written by you? Of course, yes, man. Now, I, I, now I, I, what type of songs were those? Were, there, were those... Love songs. Love the American influence. Influence love songs. So yeah, the garbage. How long mm -hmm. did it take for you to... Well, go ahead and say what you were going to say. Give me what that I'm expression. Saying, what, I, what I was saying is, um, to my, comp my father was a good musician. My elder brother, who oh, police killed when he was a, a young man, he was a great guitarist. So I, if I make a song, I don't, I don't make a poem. I sing my song, I make it a melody. It's not like nowadays a man gives you a rhythm. I sing my song. Well, we don't know about them. Too. We make song. <laughs> I really make up for our song. So... I sing my song and my brother having guitar and him play, you know. So I was so so good at writing songs. I wrote my first song when I was 12 years old. You know, like I, I was very poetic and I find out that. So when I go to my brother and I sing him, he say, all right. So he even played on my first songs as two, the one. You know, the rock said, he me do a song there. I get it. Like, my brother, I got him was 17 and she dashed for the belly, you know. See? And then I see some man have her up away now, so I said, please. Say my please and believe me when I say my girl has left me and she's gone far away. So I get it, oh what a blow. I get it, everybody know. I tell when I'm 17, you know. <laughs> so you were writing songs based on your own personal experience as well? Yes, as well, yeah, because, you know, apart from, well, the rest of our influence wasn't so widespread in the time. I, I, along the way, we sight up. And we start some more cultural things that come into the black style in the era mostly. But as a youth, when you go studio one, all of them, man, all of them are singing love songs mostly, you know? Yeah. Ken Booth, you know the thing. Yeah. So we now, we now start singing some love songs. Because we, we find out, so we, want, we, 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 we was forced to write songs in you know, other kind of being there because that's that, that, that the kind of songs where uh, happen. So, well, well, the great Cherry Rock is in the studio as well. And I'm you know, Cherry, man. you should know a lot about that time but, as well. But, but Freddie, remember, Mr. Dad used to bring all the albums from America. And I then, make one to sing them yes, over. Yes, I make one sing. Ken, Ken would sing. Because even, even the big song of Ken sing, the song I would follow. It's a big yeah, song. You, you, you understand? And then no, Alton would sing. Wow, wow, wow. Yes. Da, yeah, the da, 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 song is, a, is American classic. Yes, I, yes. I, I, it, it was all classic because it have Lady Charmers and, 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 and some other great things. Eh? Well, I remind you about something now. When you bring the song, them coming, a man sing them over like Out of Love, Ken, um, um, Swim Smith, them. Right, right, and, uh, right, right. Everybody needs love. All them yeah, songs, they're yeah. foreign songs. But yeah, when you yes. get Ken Booth, the Nat King Cole, sing. Yes. When my Nat King Cole sings, um, him tune goes up. When I fall in love. It will be forever. Yes, yes. I can just say, when I fall in love. Right, right. Him take it, him lift it up. 
It will and be power. Melody so he, can, he, he changed the melody. He changed the melody. Change the melody. Yeah. Change the melody. Cause reggae now, you know. Cause when when those songs you bring them to reggae music, no, you have to lift the key. Mm-hmm. When I fall in love, it will be forever. So in those times, and I, I'm speaking to you, and I know that the, you know the world is listening, and I'm you know those of you who are just tuning in, I have the great Cherry Rock in studio. I have the great Fred Locks, you know, on the phone lines. He's calling in from Jamaica, and this is an excellent conversation because these two brethren can give us a visual of how it used to be. So was it customary for you guys to change? The, 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 the melody of these songs or did just one and two no, people do it at a time? Well, you yeah, know, me and Cherry Rock different from them. We make our own song. <laughs> we make our friend. own song. Because, <laughs> cool friend, because you have the great Jackie Me Too. Mm-hmm. Yeah, man, I came up first. You have Jack Jerry. It's a, it's a new class of musician, so you have, to, you have to sing from key. I want you to put a year on this conversation for the youngsters that are listening. What years are we talking about here? Is this early 70s? Sixties. 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 Sixty-seven going up to early seventies. Because yeah, um, right. most of those musicians are gone, but it, it, it's a new killer of musicians. And then yeah, they, them know if you can't sing, you know, because J- Jackie Mitu is a wizard. Mm-hmm. Yeah, tell him that, Terry, when it, you sing a tune, Jackie tell you which key it is before yes. you even go on right. the instrument. We in a, we in a studio and Jackie say, a man, some man come, some man come for sing and him say, artist, come in, come sing the armor here. Because the man in our holy key comes is a armor, armor the thing. Loves yeah, him. Man. You understand me? So so when but but him say artist, why you, why you not sing a song? Sing a song. Sing a song. I mean I say, um Love is here to stay. It's a is a is a um is a foreign song. But me turn it a different way. Yes. Because I can't talk when you're in a student, you, when you get the vision. And, and, and the feel, you ride with the feel and Jackie me, Jackie me too and say, so, so you want to sing it? And I say, yes, because this is what you taught us. Mm-hmm. You have to, to yeah, sing in and key, you have to supposed to lift. See, right. and the verse of the melody, verse of the melody, sweet, you have to lift up your voice. As yeah, to lift, up, lift up your voice. So here, here's a, a great question for the two, two other virgins, right? Yeah. At this time, was everybody singing love songs, or did the Rastafari influence start to it creep into the music? Here. You, can, you can't hear, you know. The music, the music, um, what I discovered, I want to tell alternatives. I'm saying, you, this true, you are talking, you know. Most of the singers came from West Kingston. See, and the musicians them came from East. Right. Like, right? So, when I tell Alton one day, Sonic Stone, him says, true, you are talking, you know, you. So, you find now, say, when you go to the studio one, and you see them, man, they like, Alton and them. It's just birds you listen to, you know. See? Yes, yes, That's why yes. Cox could have given them some foreign tunes for convert to them one way and them sing over. See? And it became like some original songs. See? Yeah, yeah. Right. So, so even some of the tunes, even when I turn big man, I get out some tune. I know say it was it was American yes, tune. Yes. Because you say, oh, they, they write them, can't write you, you sing a tune, but Tweedle Lady, Tweedle Lady Dumb. <laughs> Look out, baby, cause yeah. here I come. Yeah. Yeah. I, I mean, I know it says a four top student. So you say you thought, it, you thought yeah. he, he sung the original? No, he, yeah. no he, 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 I'm gonna give you love that is true. It's true. Get ready. So get ready. Because rock step you are right up now. Mm-hmm. Yeah. <laughs> rock, rock step you are uh, right up. Yeah. Well, rock them come out in our ear when them, them sing some love song and them start mm-hmm. go. Like, you know, me, me know Terry Rock singing before me know him. <laughs> but I am the ruler. And that's going to stand for the minute. Listen, All them tune there. Fred, Fred, you see that song there? Double-minded man, yeah. yeah. You see them song there? And Jackie me too. Say, oh, everybody are singing and you now sing. So when we, when we sing, I am the ruler, it was from, in the Bible, it said, I am, that I am. Um, yeah. Me are the ruler, you know. Me no, the most I had that. Yes, we are talking about the most. So we start to mold in. But you see another you know song there? Don't be kind of catch it up. Because like him, I say, wait, we're not artists at the point. But at that time, the spirit of... And, and, and when we say don't be, we're talking Cox. Cox, Cox, Cox and don't be. Yes. Yes. Mr. Clement. Yeah, yeah. Mr. Clement. Clement, Dad. Clement Cox and Dad, man. Yeah, yeah. Great producer. Yeah. Yeah. You what, know, what? I'm never giving no money, but it, but it make we get no one. I yeah. have to give my big hand to that. Well, 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 sometimes the note, and I understand from you guys' days, the money mm. thing was rough. I, I don't hear much rough. artists from your days speak that they were being, you know, uh, given so much money. It was, it was rough at the time. You want to hear that joke, yeah? When we do my first song, me and my group, the lyrics, we go to Cox, you know, and say, boy, Mr. Dad, how it go? And say, 
Ah, mais après, tu es sur une grande gueule. Vous avez voir la big shot before the ball. So, we have to take taxi comme studio. The taxi man get that 30 shillings there now, because I'm so old. Can't carry every day? Yeah, and Cox, Cox is going to sign for the money. We don't sign and he moves up the paper, because we're glad for Because it's a more town of Jamaica that you know, so we ask, yo, yes. we just come and sign up. When we open up the thing, it's a two year contract we sign and never know him. I tell you, you can't do no public appearance without his consent. And you can't record for nobody else. Go through that, Rock. No, I never sign, you know. I'm just saying, you're too small. Sign. No, I never sign because <laughs> one, day, one day, one day when we were there, he said, sing a song. I'm going to go so. A double minded man is unstable in all his ways. Sees his hopes and aspirations crumbling before his faith. Him say you got a Bible. He say I just said yeah. no. I just said this early. I just said the thing started. Them time about. Them time about now the late sixties, not sixty eight, sixty nine. Yeah, so. yeah. So sixty eight, sixty nine. You know the 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 the, the spirit of Rastafari yes, starts to creep into yes, the music. Because you have a singer named. Yeah. You have a singer. Remember, remember, don't remember where you said. Ah, you have a singer named Slim Smith. Him say. Yeah, man. The greatest. Look here, children. It's gonna be rough. You know what I'm saying? Look oh, here, children. It's gonna be tough. Can't you see it? So like it for your very eyes. No school of friend, Lux, man. Yo, it's <laughs> a yeah, simple, no. so. it's a tenor, no, 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 and, no, and no, it's no. like it's a natural tendency, and it's not like false. It's one of the greatest it, singers Jamaica ever seen. Yeah, man. It's an article singer. One of Jamaica. One of Jamaica. I can. You know? Hey, you know my favorite Slim Smith rock when yeah. Nobody loves Oh, come on, that mashup dance all Slim, man. Nobody cares. Fred. Man, it's a foreign tune. Yeah. No one's home Fred. now. No one Fred. will kiss. Fred. Kiss no Fred. No one to know yes, now. Yes, I have no love at all. No one to meet. I'm the He's one the love. love. Fred. I love this. It's like, like w what's happening here is yeah. two burgeons mm -hmm. that has, you know, sharing memories from a time that m many of us who are listening cannot identify with. And we, yeah, can, no, only, we can only live what happened through the item. And this is why I say these uh, conversations are so important man. to have. It. Yeah, man. Uh, big up Fred Locks. For, 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 no, Fred, Fred Locks, big up for calling in and sharing the vibe with us. I remember, so we're not, we're not reach you yet, you know. Right? We have some music <laughs> to play for the item um, from Fred Locks catalog. For those of you who are still wondering who is Fred Locks, who is this person that Chin is revering on the phone, Cherry Rock is in the studio. Know. I want to correct you, because I look at you soon sign up. I can tell you this. I have about 10 albums lined up for release, so I have my catalog again. It's a lion log. Lion, lion log! Okay. <laughs> Listen, let me speak to the engineer. Um, Yush, do me a favor. Uh, Fred Lux is on the phone. When I reach nowhere yet, please suspend the next show so we can go into a little bit of overtime car. We still want to get some vibes from the brethren there. Right? Overdrive with that for my Overdrive with yeah. that for my brother. S special conversation we're having here tonight. Yeah, Cherry man. Rock is in the building. Yeah. Fred Lux is on the phone. Um, now, Fred, I yeah. want to I wanna capture the time or, you know, that era in which the you know Rastafari Rastafari spirit start to, to right. sweep into the music. What was happening right. at that time, and why did the music leave from you know love songs and other songs into the whole you know upliftment right. of Rastafari? Um, I think that to contribute to that enough for the producers. All right, people have come from humble beginnings, from ghetto life, and and, and them decide tell them how to sing about them tribulations because they never get no money for the, the music. So I agree out of that, that kind of liberty. Someone start singing both things that are up around them. Yep. Instead of those love songs. Yes. I like rock. No, I'm the because remember, you know. Yeah, remember most of the singers them come from out of the ghetto. Them like yeah. lean. Someone instead of instead of go rogue, that means violence and thief. Man still yeah. want to try to do a thing to uplift him whole consciousness. But the pressure was so steep, my brother. The pressure was so steep. So you find a man like me. I forgot going to myself, even though me in the environment and all the parangs are going around you, but you still have to lift up your head. Who was the first to explore that though as an artist? Because I know that, you know, Rocksteady was hitting and people were making big songs with, 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 with you know, singing love songs. Who was the first to pretty much say, you know, say we're going to suffer, we're going to truths and rights? Like, who led that march first as well, an artist? I'm going to say um, some early songs like Bob Marley. Who they come from jail, cause. Rudy, Rudy Gatebill, yes. And them children. And yeah. some song in other era, you know, um, 
dance crash or alt and let them start about the things we are going. Man, I come a dance and I want to pay. But it's that environment cause it for going to take a different turn. Then and then now most of the man them, this is my um um this is my take on it. Most of the man them know where you know the ghetto are thing, them used to smoke the good incense. Some man are made different you now and start think more I make a thing and thing, you know. And you start to feel some different vibes. Some man start going on them brain box and I say, Well, I'm have to come with something more uplifting. Something as uh, the Bible is gone as rap. Yeah, yeah. And Wailing Soul was one of the groups. Yes, yeah, one of the groups that were coming with some hardcore songs. I sing some hardcore songs. Song. You understand? Yeah. Wailing Soul was one of the groups. God bless you. Yeah, man. Soul. You know? yeah, so, man. so when, 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 when this reality part of the music, when this uh, sufferation side of the music starts to seep in, was it accepted right away, or was there pushback? No, no, nobody, no, no. Get back burner yeah. treatment. That, that is what we need yeah. to speak about. Yeah. What, what was the reception for, you know, the the artists who wanted to sing more about Rastafari, more about sufferation and things? Was it something that took a while to catch on, or was it instant hits? I don't think the it was product- instant. I don't think the producer them did ready for that. Never, that and check on the, and the people to rock. Yeah. Because you yes. must say it happened yeah. eventually. You see when um, them songs they start sing, the one them where well, they don't recognize the really great thing as if Alton sing sing some tune and start go to you know, go to that, that go to that way they know. Then we listen to it. What it yeah. will play in a dance. Yeah. But I can tell you we hear tune in a dance if we tell a friend them about it, them say a lie we are telling and ask who is up there on radio. You know, you know, because Cox and them used to have them dance every Sunday and, mm-hmm. and you have Chuck and Mola and, and you have all them places where uh, we go dance and them tunes they play at all for the press. By the flick of my wrist, mm-hmm. I brought new musical this every minute of the minute. Right. You know? because, See? because Iman don't beat the always. Iman Jew Creed. Jew Creed, Treasure Isles. Because some good songs come out of Treasure Isles. Yes, yes see, man. They have a new class. I'm a buckle. A buckle I, 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 I asked Leroy Sibbles this question mm-hmm. on Sunday and I want to ask you and Fred Lux. Uh, you know, what made you guys go to Studio One as opposed to going to Treasure Isle? Was there a different sound? Was it a different governing? What made people make that choice? I all think, right. All right. Remember what I said? You I answer, think, Terry. I think, studio, I think Studio One have a nucleus of musician coming that from Lyde like Nibs, um, Fred, Tam Philip Freda, Tam Mako, yeah. Roland Alpanso, yeah, and Andrew Mans. Yeah, man. Lester Sterling, man, as resident musician, was the best. Jackie Me Too. So you, your choice was made based on the, the, the musicians that you got the opportunity to work yes, with? Yes, yes. I went, they... I went to tell you that maybe that maybe you never know. No, no, no. <laughs> when I was 12 years old, my brother and Jackie Me Too from a band named The Rivals. See? Jackie Me Too last set of um, school books from Casey and him Ty was at my house in Abbeville. And it's Mr. Nibs with three houses from me, hear him and take him with. When I'm up the band now, I used to go around there and I used a brother named Honey Boy Martin was them singer. See? And my brother was a guitarist, Jackie the keyboardist. And yeah. I go around there one time when I was 12 and, and Honey Boy Martin never come rehearsal and them up rehearsal to them because I used to follow my brother. Sometimes he used to kick me up and run me, you know. But I'm still music to me, I still I go. I'm around there and sing and and them up um rehearse that that is home and and anniversary them two them used to rehearse so when only boy never come in a car and hear them up there and say um um how i waited for this moment to be by your side <laughs> your best friend wrote that told me <laughs> you have teared <laughs> up in <laughs> your eyes so that is home right yeah that is home to stay. Hey, 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 hey. We so you're the joke owner, Yeah, yeah, Jackie the owner. To, to, when them come late, no, the boy answer. Yeah. See, right, like, brother, take away your job, you know, the boy, I think good, you know. <laughs> <laughs> and he must say, you feel nice about that, I want to beat me up, you know. Yeah. So when Jackie goes to the one now with Mr. Nibs, he call me, you know. Yeah. He said, already when he feel like jumping, Jackie, they tell me, say, me, me want to sing for it, you know. He said, lick it and, and, and come sing, but never go and master grip and ride the tune. He like jumping. Yes, yes. Yeah, and that's the rhythm before. So anyhow, it's him carrying me to the one. So I didn't know Jackie me too from school days. So him as Rock says, the genius. Yeah, yeah. When we got my second set of tune them, you know me. Now I tune him old man say, we just sing it. I was walking down the street one day. I met this old man right along the way. And and he must say, I try to take a part of Alton with him here, sing it so. 
Hear what the old man says whenever he passes your way. Right, Just right. hear what the old man And change up my song and give me a different melody. Yeah. Yeah? Yeah. So Jackie was a genie. Yeah. 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 And yeah. if he came to the studio one. So after a while now, like if you want to go fast forward, it's when I'm about 18, I write the tune on the Black Star Line, you know. Because we are sight of the fear differently, but well, well, we never recorded it in 75. Before we get to, to Black Star Line, I'm being signaled to ask you about a song called Girls Like Dirt on Studio One. Yes, that is my, the rhythm I tell you, so Bob and the sing Desperate Love. And me and my brother go to studio and I'm having box guitar and I play it and, and, we, and Coxes are going inside and Jackie arrange it. But then now, my, my, I tell my mother, say, never a new tune, you know, I'm too comparing the music she to present. So we come home and sing, I'm here. I'm here. How do you feel when your baby is gone? My mother said, what I know you that? <laughs> Realize them give up on the rhythm. Yeah. And you know that because my brother fell up in the Bellevue. Mm -hmm. Him go up in the studio and mash up the studio and Armand Barak beat him up. And, and said a madman and bam, 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 he men up. I go Bellevue and eventually the police came. I don't like to talk about it, but the truth. Well, well, yeah. well, let's let's take a listen to that song. So, Fred, how do we get from Studio One to Black Star Liner to right. So Just Say and some of the yeah. songs that inspired us so much? You know, we get to that now. Every time we go to Cox, I, I remember, so we don't get no money. We start saying, boy, I'm done with singing. I don't have to sing a note more. See? So, in other time, you know, we get more conscious. I get conscious and the said time I met him I ride black side up. We left on the beach out of you and and, and I dread I dread near him oh and I look for me and said, like oh the animal side up and stop singing with a love song and he said to me, say, you're a little thing yeah. And I say, seven miles of black star line come here. And I said, work with that. And we go by go read a, a philosophy and a pin and Marcus guy where I bridge in the twelve side to bring out. That's a little booklet. And come back the next year and say, Oh, and we finish right that song go to the side line. I said, nice youth. But now I'm going to myself, no, no one has a Rastafari. I'm going to come for record. I'm going to stop singing. I'm going to do a commercial thing, regular Babylon music. I have been going. You know. <laughs> <laughs> yes, that? So at the so, time, at the time, were there other artists like yourself that started to move away from reggae and they did love singing and just say, yo, straight militant message music? Well, I, there may be a few because some man did have more, uh, more stamina than me. But they were kind of too sensitive, you know. Mm -hmm. <laughs> you know, see that me, I said, boy, well, it's coming like a, them things that are going to make you really can survive. Because, you know, see the financial reward. But you never vex more than part, you know, so I said, better do something different. Mm -hmm. See? But at that time, it's more spirituality as well, I could have tell you. That's so why the Bible was gone and we are looking at some deeper things, you know. So yes, it's like yes. you're going to exile for, 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 for improve your style, you know, and get versatile, you know. You know see it? So in, in exile, um, what are some of the classical songs that, well, songs that are no classical that you came up with that in those times? All right, would you believe this? When I did um, this Black Star album, it's 10 tracks. See? I did Black Star Line on a song named Time to Change, people call it last days. Right. And, and I sing along with a song that I recorded before. Um, we produced it yourself as the lyrics. And one more song named Wolf Wolf. The next six songs, I wrote them in one night. I, used to, I did have some different songs to the album, and like they come to me, and I, uh, and I said, Why are you asking me um, two last man? So I said, I sing it. I come from an herb camp one night, and you like music, I play in the background. Music now, I play every time I stop, I hear nothing. I'm just a sing. I'm going to write all them songs the one night. Reason after them songs, so just say, um, which one again? Um, Don't let Babylon use your son of the Almighty. So I'm going to write six songs. And when I go to studio now, for God's voice, for the band, leave the music them. Come here, sing for the music, make and nobody give me a rhythm. So I'm going to go there now. I'm going to have a tune here, Rastafari rule, and some other tune. Judge not to call to appearance. And I said to the brother, the producer, him, you both. So I have six different songs we want. I said, brother, don't want you to change up the thing for me, you know. And I said, boom, and start singing soldiers there. And, and Pablo Black said, boy, if I don't wait go, I could hear the rest of them because it's bad enough. <laughs> See? So I just I gave the word. And great to the company of those that publish it, not shit, you know. Publish it, not so, shit. So many.
classical Fred Lock songs. Those of you who have been following Rastafari from them time until now, it, it is hard for you not to know the works of Fred Locks. Those of you who have not, I want to give you guys a taste of some of his uh, wicked, wicked, wicked selections. Um, one of my favorite Fred Lock songs is Sing Along. Sing along yeah, is just, you know, I, I, it's one of them songs there where, you know, and there's another one that, uh, you know, I have a joy. Yeah, man. And, and, and these are the songs that I would like. So, brethren, um, who are responsible for uh, following the conversation with music, I want to hear I have a joy. I want to hear sing along. I want to hear Black Star Liner. I want to hear some classical. We'll, man, we'll, go play them tune. You make people get to looking at themselves for tune. Not, my, my, not just my tune. The songs in them vein, they like, you know. When me all Terry Rock tune, I'm the ruler. And, and them, me all them tune, when me, when me just like 12 times, I say, I didn't mind I've seen it, but I'm the greatest artist them this, you know. And I have a love song there, before we know Terry Rock, I'm about to say, You cannot <laughs> leave me, girl. Stop it. Stop it. You when cannot I... go. No. Must not make, make me blue. blue. Cause I'm falling in love with you. Blood, beat up your lips. I just said, I'm far up, far up. Far up, far up. Yo. Can, 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 we, can we do this here live on Sound Chat Radio? I, I just want to do this before um, we go over to some of um, 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 Fred Locke's selection, right? Um, Fred Locke says that he was told. Him no know nothing about harmony because he's a leader. Right. Him lead. Yeah. In the conversation, you tell me, say, harmony are what you love. Yeah, harmony. <laughs> so can you guys pick a song live here on Soundchat Radio? Fred Lock sing the lead and you sing the harmony. Sing back, fall, <laughs> sing back falling in love with you. Let's yes, do it now. Yes. 718-554-8598 is that number in studio. You guys know when you lock into Soundchat Radio, the conversations right, are ready, different. Right. Yeah, I'm already. Every you time. ready? You cannot leave me, girl. Step it up, little bit. Step it up. You, you cannot go. go. You must not make, make me blue. Because I'm, I'm falling, falling in love with, with you. you. There's something we must do. There's there something, something we, we must, must do. do. That time has come. That, that time has come. come. Mm, do things we know is true. Do things, things we, we know, know is true. Because I'm falling in, in love with you. It's a sweet part, no. <laughs> no sorrow. No more pain. pain. I, I love just you. you. My world won't be safe. My, My world, world won't be the same. Because I'm falling in love with you. With you. I pray like to see you. You know, easy, you know. You think you get easy. Listen. But you know the words, although you talk them out, you know. You know, you know them. You know, you know them. You know the tune them long time before me know I feel like a kid in a candy store right now. One of my favorite, one of my favorite, favorite Fred Lock hey. selections, of course, is Sing Along. I want to beat that song there right now. Yeah, I want to say something to you now. Although you're Fred Lock, you can't play the falling in love. If you find that, I'll give you a million. <laughs> We <laughs> <laughs> want the original Rock, version. Rock. Yeah, Terry Rock and uh, Leroy and Rocky Man kill them. Yeah, chat board. <laughs> 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 hey, you know what? I was singing from 12 times on the verse, and some man say, Only the still reigning champion, and Terry Rock protect the world, you know. <laughs> Can a man not sing like one, you know? Oh, you tell them, Rock? No, brother. Make a big brother. Make a you tell them, no friend. Make a you tell them, you know? All right, now, straight, we are straight to you. Having a conversation hey, with two go great on, go artists. Here, to blow. I'm going to play a second fiddle. No, friend, Rock. We, we, we both... We both shelled it down there. <laughs> as the young boy yes. said. We both shelled Shelled it, it as yes. the young boy yes. said. Yes. Listen, yes. sing along to Fred Locks. Turn up your radios loud. Let's yeah, do that bro. now. Bully up! Fred Lux. 
We have got yeah. to touch this. Come here, me, me hear something like it, you know. So we we'll do our thing, a different thing. Sing along. Let it Red go. Jeans. To the world. Sing friend, along. To the world. 718 is that number <laughs> in studio. Hey, friend hey. Nass in Jamaica. Now you're going to do a collab, man, because I'm going to ask you, you know. We'll do it, you know, because we're still there, you know. Oh, we're ready, you know, brother. In time, you we're know, we're ready. We're ready more than Freddy. Every time. Fred Lux, mm-hmm. I want to go through the catalog. You ready? Yes, sir. Are, are the lion log, as you said. Lion log, we'll let you know. 718-554-8598 is that number in studio. 718-554-8598 is that number in studio. Turn up your radios loud. Fred Lux is on the phone, and we're going through the catalog, the lion log right now. Excuse yeah. me. I don't have them two. They're just right here, you know. Talk to me about the journey, my brother. Well, the journey is so sweet because they're no, no. We still left on the journey. I will not give up the fight. Because we are some, we are called a prayer warrior. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Like the Every Christian, they would have said. Because we are the real Christians still, you know. Because we don't time. know, so we accept the Christ, you know. Yeah. And we, are, we, are, we, are, we identify with the Israel the, the, from the tribe of Judah. Because yeah. Judah is God known. His name is great mm-hmm. in Israel. Hey, I don't want to do this in the studio. And I'm all over with me from the 70s with some bad tunes, you know. Yes, big up the deuce in the studio. Yeah, what I want to do is make some, some we will eat up the thing. <laughs> <laughs> but I'm a big brother still, you know what I mean? I want to have children, man. So, you see right now, I tell you, we we'll give thanks to this because you have to be in it to win it, you know. And, yes, and quitters yes. never win and winners never quit. Mm. So, we're glad to say, we're not highlight for things. You know, come here, big up, cherry rock every time, you know. Come here, tell us. <laughs> Me and him destroy a 12 times celebration. That's when the people left out them said, Boy, I don't have to take the world. And I have to say it again. Red Locks. The man has sing like a bird. Red Locks. I yes. know we want the DJ to play a song. A song named Time to Change. Yes. These are the times good. to change your ways. Remember, I said them songs are set from a long time in a Red Locks. I will yeah, not play. Try, then it depends on the same album. You know, where you then you know that me I tell him because it's past, present, and future. And I say, We have to give thanks. Chin, who is a part of we from them time then, and yeah. build this foundation that him could have given you the privilege for you see right now right. Give you see right now with me and you we have to blaze some fire serious fire take it in taking it to the next level so we have to All give right. thanks to sound chat ready for provide this yeah. pa- platform Oh. Yeah, man, you said it's two just call. Yeah. Every time I sing for celebration for 12 tribe, sister boy come to me and say, I'm in a year you sing that tune, there's a time to change, you know. Yeah. When I hear you sing it, you never sing it for stage yet. And I'm one of my favorite tunes. Be, before you go further, though, let me ask you this, right? Because I, I want to get back into some great conversation. Because one of the things that I like to accomplish is that not only do the people love your music, right? But I like when people understand who you are and what inspired you to make the music, right? Um, throughout this conversation, you have mentioned 12 Tribe. You know, what role does 12 Tribe play in your musical career and your, your, right. your tribe? A big role, okay? The truth, the truth after the truth. When Mr. am going to exile, you just know. I'm going to ride that tune, the black signer from 68, over a, a player field in Arborview, and say, Booty, the one who became the producer, come towards me. But 12 times, you always segregate themselves. I love to have the truth. If you're not joining 12 times, and you have black, them say, you have bag of wire or something, and they're too much rich. So I used to see them, Rasta, and never hear me yet, you know. And I see him come over the player field and head towards me. And when he reached him, he said, Rasta, you look frightened, what's going on? I said, well, I mean, I talked to him, say, yeah, man, I said, I look at you, come up on my yard, you know, and I play a cassette. I saw the tune going on, the man comes so I'm putting the thing in the play and start playing. No, you know, me that sing style with a box guitar with a play, and I'm on a beat from a, pian, a, a pian pan. And the man said, I'm on in a 12 tribe, you know, I'm on, you know, it's back to Africa, Rasta deal. I'm on a love producer tune, I never produce no tune yet, you know. And I said, serious, I said, yeah, man, I said, well, you know, so I know I'm produ- um, singing a tune. I am on in um on a different levels, I know in another recording thing. And then the man said to me, If you have a talent and bear it, you will lose it, you know. See. So, you know that Saturday, we go to my yard and could have sweep the library here. If you have a talent and bear it, you will lose it. I get a I'm head right through, you know. The next day I'm gonna look for him, which is a Sunday, but uh, at twelve time meeting him gone. I'm going to my yard and I see him. The Monday I'm going back to my yard again and see his wife come out and say, The joint can't work, you know. Because I tell her, I said, I come to him, and by the evening, I back again, and I said, Yeah, we are come to the thing, Father, you ready for record? I said, yeah, I said, yeah, all right. <laughs> and we got record, Black Star, in the last year. That is mostly some 12-time musicians, like 
Uh, Baga Walker, the great basis. Tell Rock when the man come from Pablo Black. Pablo Black. Pablo Black. Mm-hmm. Get, are you been trying to really know play on the first session there? Eh? Yeah. A three guitarists, you know, Earl Trina Philip Smith, Judge Jerry. Yes. The youth of my car with me where I play guitar and him, a Wad Roberts, great part. Right, right. Then you have no Pablo back on keyboard. See? Al- Albert ben Bo, Bo, No, Ben Bo mm-hmm. play on them mm-hmm. sessions. Ben mm-hmm. Bo play a drum. See? And bag up on bass. Right. Yeah, man. And I said, learn it. When I tell you now, you know, I sing my tune like me, I go on like me, I do this one. I said, Civil Mads with Black Star Lighters coming in. And bag up said, them pretty voice now work mm-hmm. my repatriation tune. Drop the key and sing it lower. Right. I said, uh, I'm just looking at me and I said, I said, several miles of black town. Right, and right. I said, I said, you spoil up my song. I'll make home with them so I'm not giant 12 times. We're Mr. Booty. You make it 12 times for them spoil up my song, you man. And the song, well, yeah, and the song became well, a major hit. Yes, Tina Smith to me now. Just go with them, say, man. I'll give you an intro. I'll uh, 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 give you an hit song. And Tina Smith started. Ding, 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 ding. And Pablo Black just harmonized it from the keyboard. Right, right. And I said, blurred me. I couldn't believe when the song done. When it come out to blow out, wow, I said, take a place like a storm. So the man started to say, I saw you to sing all the songs, then I know, they come out to the building. So the man went home from studio one day, I said, yo, I got to the car singing, man. We used to the studio and used to sing better. I said, the man, I said, I'm give me a style, you know, and it worked. <laughs> so so <laughs> was, was, was Black Star, Star Liner your big song? Was that the breakthrough strong song for you at the time? Yes, man. Because when we do that, you know, we get a tour of England. We go there. It's a it, 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 um, star, um, star single of the year. See? It's on every chart. It's all the magazine that I write about it. Wow. See? Because I come in an era when people want to look for hope. Yes. Looking for something. Yeah, 75. When I say, boy, them dispose of his majesty. I'm here thinking about repatriation. You know? So, we all... I tell you the truth, I'm going to England for a tour in the 1970s. Now, a white guy comes to me and says, Fred, look, they love you. You have the right complexion to make it, you know. I think I'm thinking that I'm going to make it so hard. You know? <laughs> <laughs> but it worked out, you know, because I, 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 I was in uh, everything. Because we are leaning from the spiritual, you know. Sin. And, and I just give you the right thing. Because Terry Rock can tell you, when we joined 12 tribes, the thing was that. Read the Bible, a chapter there from Genesis yes. to Revelation. Yeah. So that now make we get time. Uh, lyrics for kill now. And lyrics for heal too. And lyrics for give. Can you know? Who, who are the lyrics in the Bible? You know? Yeah, man. Can we find something we know for sing about now, you know? And we have to say, wow, this sweetie, man. Energize so, now. Yeah, we get wicked there. Yeah. But wicked in our righteousness, you know? And we're spiritually firm, you know? Yeah. And feel like you have on the arm of righteousness because you can't defend it, you know? Because yeah. when a man come at all about him, I quote Bible, and the wrong set of people him come to him, come to 12 tribes, you know, we start telling about the whole book. Because I'm only read verse here, we read chapter here. Yeah, yeah. Seen. <laughs> Listen, so play a, go ahead. Then play a big part, because I'm most of the musician for my Black Sign album was 12 tribe members. Up to the hands, man, they play up on two rest of So just say. Right. Yeah, Mikey Carroll and them, man. Yeah, there. Yeah. Yeah, it, it was like, a 12 tribe contingent take me over and make me up a giant too. <laughs> Those of you who are just listening or just tuning in, we are talking to Fred Locks, of course, veteran artist, uh, spiritual artist, Rastafari artist, uh, a man who has made some very strong songs, some staple songs in our culture. Fred, what are you up to these days before we go? All right, we just have a new album come out with 16 songs named Bigger Tunes. You see, you play one tune now, Fred, Christian Empress. See? Right now, we just do a remake of uh, 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 Old Man Said for Black Hadred. It's a 16 track album again. It's just two songs leave for mix. So, in plus, I do my own album. I kill them with music. I, I slide down by a play up on the, the new white name, the Old Man Said, because the man said it was his favorite tune. I never knew me sing it. So, he might go put some drum roll on it and we're going to mix it and the tune ready for the road again. But we have to tell the producer them, he's on come again. I don't want to. I don't want to really compete with myself because too much thing. The next man in a jersey have an album with my name, Doorkeeper. Everything about pure life thing we do. We're not doing a computer thing because it's not live, it's dead, you know. See? Still? So we're, we're going back to basics and real, real thing we're like, you know. So we have it. And we have the whole family because they inspire me to write whole for songs. I'm just to write songs and I sing songs because I want to tell you one good wisdom. One time up at Bob Marley, Island House, before I turned um, the museum. We have beat pure lamb's bread, you know. And still, so um, a man go make some juice. I'm gonna bring it. The blender full, full of Bob Marley favorite cup, you know. See? And Bob Marley say, 
And the virgin them is so good to do, so one man them eat and think so much selfish, man. Get the virgin them, and just come out to the basket and full of lambs where they start building some stuff. And I'm just like, I and say, you know, a song is not a song to let record. I hear me go, man, say, what is man you have about, man? <laughs> I'm a come to I say, he said, I find out what it means. I say, me that busy about money or not, now I kill him with music. <laughs> mm-hmm. I record songs like dirt, and tell me the word, my holy for songs. Holy for songs. Right now, me have about 10 albums lined up to come out. Now, I say, take on the time, take on the time, don't bring them to. See? What, what's, what's it like nowadays, now that you're in your veteran stages, um, when you. Um, encounter other artists are you getting that respect for your contribution in the industry all right i would think so for the first time them start to recognize all right mackerel lose him, him get them him put get amputated and him keep a virtual thing of um robert livingston place mm-hmm. and them have shakademo sound players assassin peter metro Bury and myself prince allah then and couple of and paper tan and the brother were MC. it. I don't go into this your time for singing. The brother were MC. the show him, come out and say, Look here, nobody wants to say, Fred Locks, I'll sing you. Man, I'm thinking, brother, everybody, I'll make a boy and all. He said, well, I hear it up to now. You yeah, see it. But the man him started saying, Yo, you're still a nice boy. Man. And I turned 71 and man said, I'll lie out tell you, no look so. You're a little boy you're talking about. I mean, I go out wicked pan, with special and I sing good in a school. I say, everybody has a boy. Like, you're the only man right now. To me, that Jamaica, I'm not know what I'm you know. Yeah. Yeah, I hear the old man right now, we are singing, so you know. Yeah. And you go on good, and you must show the respect. But I'm here with him now, I say, Yo, are you, brother? You know, I'm here, come on, I say, Yeah. I go up past his life, when I go up past his life, the year before yesterday. So I eat on the road, I hear someone, I say, So not the Fred Lock say, no. You know. I, 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 I remember one time that, you know, you were, you pretty much were touring with Sizzle in the early days, correct? You no, know, when I was them really, we do some Jamaican show, but we do a black style and I, I, I collab with him, you know. Mm-hmm. We do it over here. Yeah. But we never toured him so per se, but came and used to keep some, some dance hall thing and we sing from the sound. But we never go overseas with him, but we didn't have the stables with him and Lucian and them two fatties. Yes. Exterminator. Yes. Yeah. But we never go for none of the tour with them overseas, so to speak. Because at the time when them bus out, we have seen them a farm before me, know them, because I go a father go take in. Um, Lucian, uh, when have, it's me again, John, them two, them, and Mikey, and Sizzler, and Fatty see me and say, when I come to Jamaica, I want to record me. So I come and drop me the stables, you know? See? So, yeah, man. Such, an, such an extensive career, my brother. We could talk forever. Those of you, you know. who are listening, listen. Um, this was a, a, a great conversation for me. Fred Locks on the phone, uh, Cherry Rock in the studio, and, and the bridge in them does a whole lot of joy. And, 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 but and, I have to one more thing again, though, my youth. Yes, my brother. Then, I want to hear, hear falling in love and Cherry Rock want your time to change. You can't do, do that on a day. F- <laughs> falling in love and time to change. Yes. Falling in love is it's me, Ryan, and Rocky. Falling in love and time to change. Right. See if you can find that for me, Ruben. Falling in love and time to change. Request, of course, from the big man himself. I, I just want to say nothing, too. I just want to say nothing. Fred Lux. You, yeah. You, you saw life stay, though. We never get the accolades and certain things then. But now, two, two sound chat readers, I'm have to big it up. Because we can it, it, it show some transparency right now and make the world yeah. know so well then. We are live artists. Yes. And we like really put some things to the people and, and, and to, the, to, to the generation to come, especially the generation to come. We want to leave something with them. And with this chin, we we'll put your it right now. We want to have something. Because right now, me and Fred have some dangerous song, you know. I just put it together now and show the world, say, yes, we are here. You're still here. We are still here. Still and, here. The, and the talent is still this firm. Is still, no, clean, we're clean. Still firm. Le- le- live le- and direct. You know how much more them ask for time to sing live and direct and them all get to us up. Yeah, and get, uh, uh, I hear me and Rock, I go on a little while. <laughs> and, and you are in Jamaica and I'm here. And, yeah, and, and, and listen, those of you yeah. who are, are, are listening to our conversation right now, remember, you know, Cherry Rock is in this studio each and every Wednesday, right? Yes. From 8 to 10. So those of you who thought he was just an ordinary person, an ordinary broadcaster, Fred Locks let, let, let it out of the bag now. Fred Locks will tell us that this man I come from Studio One Days. I know what happened. Them Fred, I'm like, puss. <laughs> hey, you know what I'm saying? Chin, you are here that history now. I'll spread like that talk. All respect. You think me have a song name? 
People get ready to do do rock steady. People get ready to do do rock steady. Out in the moonlight, we will dance. We saw him hear about the song. A Slim Smith has sing the song. Yes. Slim Smith has sing the song, you know. That's me. Yes, you, know, you know, remember the song, man? Because me did sing. Like, man. You know, know the song because me did sing. I'm feeling lonely. You were the only. And With you job by my side, things will be all right. Out in the moonlight, we will dance. When, when Slim Smith come back, Slim Smith. When you are a song. Yeah, man, I hear right. you say. I hear you song. I'm me right it, you know. Yes, but, man. Me just humble myself and say yes. A, a, lot, of that, a lot of that happened yeah, in those man, times, yeah, correct? Yeah, yeah, a lot yeah, of man. that happened yeah, in man, those like times. A, yes, a, man. It was like a norm. It's a bugger song we have a studio one. We don't release, you know. But me too. Mr. Dad, I'm a father from a biological father. I'm a respect him because he gave me the privilege to be here. Right. We come for sing, us to be having this conversation. To, ah, Trin, for us to be having this conversation. So I give thanks. I could have wheel and go on, but I couldn't do that. I, I can't do that. At the first, yes, I'm going to sing. I'm, 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 I'm because of that. Yeah. But people continue when, when, when we never get no financial yeah. reward. And that makes me who I am yeah. today. Sing. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, man. Give thanks to my sad dad. I'm yeah. gone, but yeah, it's a good God. work. Blessed, blessed love, you know. Blessed love, you know. Because without him, all people are saying, cuss him. But the Spirit said to me, say, don't do that. Don't cuss Bear him. your tribulation, you know, because the time will come where you have to represent. Here it is. Well, let me, yeah, drop, let me drop this song by request, of course, from Fred Locks himself before we wrap it up. Yeah. Take a listen, people. Turn up your radios loud. Big Chod. <laughs> that part of that, you know, easy. You know, you think you're easy. You ain't getting to rock. Yeah, I don't think you're going to love before me, though. And true. We ain't getting to rock. We ain't getting to rock. We ain't getting to rock. That's true, man. That's true. Remember, yeah, I love my girl now. I'm dead. You know, so we touch some tunes still, you know. We touch yeah, some man. tunes, so we have them in the archives, cars. Yeah, hey, man. You see Carlton? Carlton. Yeah. You see Carlton, him? are you shoes? Yeah. I used to see him one time, you know. But but uh, that uh, before he come down with you. Yeah, I'm not seeing from that. Because you know, so he's a shoes too. You know that. Yeah, yeah man. <laughs> 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 but did I miss you about that now? No, it's a mistake. It's a, it, no, boy, it, it, we have to deal with it, you know. Carl, 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 no, I'm a big brother. You know what's on name? As long as there's love, as long as there's life to enjoy, I'll always belong to you. To you. Yeah. Just on wind and rain, whether I lose or gain, I'll always belong. To you. To you. The winter, yeah, man, you're, man. You're, you're, no. the winter has come and gone, leaves wither and fall. This is a feeling the father should help us to have for a decay. Have for a decay. Don't no, play with me, no, Kasha. <laughs> Chill. Yo. Chill it easy. <laughs> and then, man, I ain't brother them, I have a senior. Yeah, man, I'm saying, I have a senior. Man in family. Man in family. Yeah, man. When man, they sing some of the sweetest tunes. I love me forever. Yeah, man. That's a, a, a serious thing, serious, serious. Yeah, man. things we have to go to. We have to get You know, it's what I love. You know, my favorite card and shoes. Love is a treasure. Yes, <laughs> it's true. <laughs> and it shines it's bright. Wicked <laughs> Tony, man. Yeah, man, in the hearts of me and you. and you. Wicked, wicked, wicked. Yeah, wicked. yeah man. We'll go I, together I, and in and. I am just sitting here and listening and watching you guys have so much fun and just soaking in it, soaking up all the knowledge. <laughs> and oh, Rasta, we sit and touch it back, you know. But we we'll change up the year, we change up the year, you know. Rasta, Rasta, Rasta life is real. Yes, it's it, so man. real. You hear it? Well, yeah, that's man, Rasta, we, we have a whole power work for you, you know. But as I said, yes, man. Sound chat radio and the platform large and big. And it load. So we have to take it to the world. I think we uh, should do more of these. We're not self-centered, but yeah, may I tell you something. I got to there from June with my brother in Black Hadred. Yeah. And he must say, oh, you know, I record not true. It's amazing, man. Mm-hmm. So, in my record, we have album. We have, we have um, Leroy Gibbons, Anthony B. We have a thing. Yeah. So, but, but when I, when the tune the first tune, my record when I was 17 years old. I have a rhythm where it sounds near to it. And I say, you know, my tune can fit on it. So, July the 11th, my record that tune there. Right. And by August, I record four more tunes. And by November, I'm gone 14 tunes. And the engineer said, 
Fredlocks come last out of the box and go around everything. <laughs> <laughs> Well, well, I just, I just well, you know our thing, we don't really pen nothing, we just sing, sing we the inspiration sing, and work it in the character. Yeah, man. So you don't know the thing, sir. So, I... Never tune. Go ahead. Never tune. Never tune him. It's, it's going to be all right. I sing both black and white for you, Unite. And black and white, what kind of tune that? You know? And right, I'm saying I'm favorite tune. Because I'm going to give me some lyrics for that tune. They say rock, blow, I'm going to tell you. Yeah, man, true, man. I got, I I got work, two man. more songs to play before we go. Right. All right, brother. One, yeah. one song is of course Chris, Ch- Christian Empress, yeah. which of course is from Fred Locks, and the other song is The Ruler, which is from yeah. Anthony Ellis. Because we can't have the conversation without playing The Ruler, and I don't hear the nobody ruler. say nothing about The Ruler from night. Well, nobody can fool ya. You. You're still in the school, ya. <laughs> Drop it. Drop it. Come yeah, on. By that trust that in the Lord shall be like Mount Zion that cannot be removed but abided forever, you know. And as the mountains are round about Jerusalem, so the Lord people are round about his throne. Can you ask her now? You see right now? Long activity, hopeful living and thing, we make we can stand up in other thing. And the youth them know what tell them say, when you're taking life on them things there. Yeah, you, you decrease the population. You know, you, they must go like them better than COVID. So you have to People will stop killing off one another. Do some do some constructive thing. Make we, make we live, make we live, make we live. But I die of old age. You know, because me I say, well, I can't believe we are going. Although the prophecy are fulfilled still. Mm-hmm. But still have to talk about it. I know, so the generation of vipers, they're going to go down in a hell. Right, Terry? Yeah, man. Yeah, man. That's what you mean. Because Those the Bible... that are with the Lord are called and chosen yes, and faithful. Yes, yes, yeah. Yes, we're Bible students. You yes, see, yes. we're going to tell them, say, yo. Them works dirty, man. But yeah, them rather not the death of a sinner, but that them repent, you know. Man, I say we're righteous or nothing, you know. Mm-hmm. But we have to try daily for, for, for why not do right and live, you know. Good song, so, good song. So, that me I tell the people, them say, boy, you have a better chance to live and save your soul because the flesh will fail, you know. Yes, yes, yes. There's three score and seven, uh, three, three score and ten years, you know, if by reason of strength to live yeah, longer. Long, long. Give thanks. You see, you give yeah, thanks, yeah. but you know, say, Man never make for, for, for war and kill off one of them. Better, you know, better the flesh the care and go away, but the soul stay, you know? You see, you see, Fred, in Adam, all man died, you know, and in Christ, make a quickening yeah, quick spirit, you know? So we we'll rise again, you know? So yeah, man, we're dead already, man. Yeah, 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 yeah. We conquer that. We conquer that. We conquer that, yeah, we conquer yeah, man, we conquer that because yeah. the second death have no power. Mm-hmm. But you see, when you go down, when the wicked um, slay the righteous, him shall go down in hell. See? <laughs> Mm. I was sure about that. So I tell them, so my one I do, you know. Because the people go and say, there's not an afterlife and everybody go dead. But, yo, know, there's a redemption that, you know. Then the book does not show you? The book show, show you, you man. Know. If it was right. in this life, we have hope. We'd be men most miserable. So right. we have to seek E first the kingdom of God you know, and His righteousness. And all His righteousness. All, and all things. things shall be added. Straight. Some people don't believe all the part of no. but see the kingdom no, no, of no, God that... and all things. All His righteousness more important. They love to leave all that, you see. Greetings, Brother ah. Levi. How are thou? Are you now? Brother Levi, hold up yes. one minute now. It is our talk. Sister Reuben is greeting you. I am the priest. So it's hard to quiet me down. Enough, and you are the priest. You know. <laughs> You're the priest. <laughs> Brother Levi, I give much thanks for give this thanks interview, too. okay? Yeah, all right. Thank and you. And just too. stay strong. Yeah, I wanted to say one thing, but I always leave all this part as rock emphasize. I say. Who can understand his errors? Cleanse thou me from secret faults. Keep back thy servants also from presumptuous sins. Let them not have dominion over me. Then shall I be upright and innocent from the great transgression. Let the words of my mouth and the meditation of my heart be accepted in thy sight, O Jah. And I strengthen and I redeem. Who live it and reign it. The heart and thoughts of all living things. Jah, Rastafari. Bless everyone. Between, between. I want to tell you thanks, yes, sir. All right, my twin. All right, sir. Love all right, you. my twin. Love you, Same sir. Same way, all I all love. Right. <laughs> all right. All right, mister. All right, brother. No respect for what you do. You ah. see, you go, you, you go, you know, you know so I'm going to tell you, so I was going over, everybody will interview me, so they might make the next person, like you can carry over, car. 
Why for relax and talk to him and about him attack him? It's not even that you can talk. You have so it's much of a so story. Much yeah, yeah you, you, know, you know, you know, you're not somebody that talks all the time. So when I do no. get people like you to talk, you know, we'll talk forever. And if I don't stop myself, we're going to be here till tomorrow morning because there's just so much to talk to you about. You have done so much. Your um, spiritual journey has been so impactful in the I industry. Um, your music is going to last forever. Amongst I and I as Rasta. So give thanks for brother. Word. So to Jabi the glory. To Jabi the glory. To Jabi the glory, you know. Yeah, man. Great things he has done. And, 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 and keep the new music coming here, sir. Wow, I'm going to kill them with it. I'm going to flood the market. <laughs> but man, if you're standing that, I'm going to kill it. I'm believe that. Yeah. That's all right. All right, yeah, my brother. Right. Yeah, man. 718-554-8598 is that number in studio. It is Revelation Wednesdays. Um, and we're going to be doing interviews from time to time here at Soundchat Radio. I may not be in studio. Cherry Rock may be doing them by himself. Or, you know, we, we, but you guys got to keep it locked. It's the only Rastafari show on this platform. And you got to be locked in on Wednesdays from 8 to 10. Entertainment, information, and great conversation here. From Revelation Wednesdays. And Cherry, it's crazy, you know, because the gangster pastor, listen, right? Yeah. And, um, you know, he says to me, um, and I, I'm going to put him on the spot now. He says that I'm loving this. Yeah. And what he, the, the part that I believe that he was commenting on yeah. is the scriptures that you guys were reciting yeah. from the Bible, yeah. right? And, um, you know, a couple of weeks back, him and I spoke, you know, live on air. Yeah. And I was trying to pretty much explain to him that Rastas are Christians and yeah. are believers of Christ and yeah. Christ-fearing people. Yeah. Yeah. And um, he was not able to make that connection. He's never made that connection yeah. before the conversation yeah. that we had, yeah. right? So I think that now that he's hearing you guys in action, yeah. someone like yourself that's coming from Studio One, yeah. somebody who's been recording for 17, yeah. since yeah. 17 yeah. years, yeah. and, you know, he is Rastafari yeah. right, to the yeah. utmost, yeah. Yeah. you know what I mean? Yeah. Um, I think he's a little bit more convinced. So... One of these days, I would like to either get him to share your platform, platform. or you share his, his platform, platform to have a really great discussion yeah, yeah. here on Soundchat Radio. Well, well that, that is good because in this time, you need authenticity and you need, and you need good conversation. So, I mean, if the, the Lord's willing, Chin, we'll, we'll be a part of it. Give, you, give thanks, my brother. Yeah. And before we go, the ruler. <laughs> and you know why we're going to play the ruler? Because this one stands predominant. This one stands predominant. Call it live, talk to me. Chip, big up, my blessing. Chip, to feel blessed for listening. Feel blessed, man, I'm liar. You feel blessed it's listening? Spiritual, spiritual, sunshine, college, you have to call it. Give thanks, my brother. And it's here each and every Wednesday night, you know, so make sure you lock in. Yes, sir? Lock in, man. Lock in. I'm Martin, ever lock in to Soundchat. You know that. Martin, big up yourself. Big up, big up. Call your life. Blessed love. Blessed love. <laughs> yes. <laughs> Turn down your radio, please, and listen to your phone. Turn down my radio. Ah, there you go. Oh, I'm hearing you again. Turn down your radio and listen to your phone, please. 718-554-8598 is that number in studio. We got a couple of minutes before we sign off, but those of you that want to comment about some of the things that you heard tonight, please do. Classic Cherry Rock in studio. Fred Locks on the phone. It doesn't get any better than that when we're speaking about Rastafari music. Call your life. That was so wonderful. I'm so grateful to have been in the midst have heard all those inspiring words of wisdom and music coming from the great Cherry Rock and Mr. Fred Locks, one and only. So, Brother Chin, I'm just giving thanks to you and to the DJs in the studio. And do have a blessed and safe journey. In Yashu's name we pray. Rastafari to Lashiai. Give tongues. Give tongues. Big up yourself, Sister Cindy. 718-554-8598. <laughs> Call your life. Yo, gangster pastor in the building. Gangsta! <laughs> Brother, them say you must knock where you don't know. Right now, I feel like a church with the death of the last hour. Yeah, oh, the reasoning so sweet and conscious. Yo. Well, 
Well, let's see. Brother. My family, my family, the Lord, the Lord gave the word and greatest the company of those that publish it. And this is the yeah. time, this is the time we're supposed to publish the word. We can't water it down. So if God bless brother. you to be in this time, let your light so shine before me, my brother. Well, I have to tell you, I say, yo, I want to bless my soul just now. Like, oh, at them reason, it's like, it's like music got back life yes, again. Yes, yes, yes. And if we can bring reggae back to this, we will save reggae. You, you know, my brother, I'll tell you something. Reggae has gone away now. It only takes the right mindset right now. And, and I think Soundchat have the right platform. This is it. That's, that's what we can, that's we can, yeah, yeah, that's we can yes, meditate and reason together and bring the truth to the forefront. This is the then platform. The We're not going around life, the thing. Brother. We're not going around the thing. Life, you know, as, I, right. as, I, as, I, as I said over and over, religion just caused division. Can we just realize that you know, we have said the same thing? We have said the same thing. So let's big up Chin, big up Soundchat, big up the item. Big up Fred Locks, learn a lot tonight. Yeah, and we just yeah. love when we hear. I see you, Steve. Give thanks, my brother. 718 554 8598 is that number in studio. One thing I can guarantee you guys when you log on to the Soundchat platform, you're going to learn something, right? And um, you're going to witness things that you just thought was impossible. Like, you never thought it was possible for us to have a vibe with, 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 with Cherry Rock. And Fred Locks at the same time. You didn't think it was possible to have Cherry Rock singing harmonies for Fred Locks singing the lead. You just didn't think that was possible. But we made it happen. Call you live. Hello, good night. Good night. I must say it's very, very inspirational. I have met um, Cherry Rock a couple of times. I kind of know him somewhat to say hi, hello. And it's very, very inspirational. I learn a lot tonight. I like the love. It's very um, spiritual, very uplifting, and this is great. I really, really enjoyed it. I really love it. Give thanks. Thanks right. for tuning in. Thank, Bit up. Thank Bit you up. It's great. Great, bless, Chin. Bless, bless. And people remember, it's here each and every Wednesday, right? Revelation Wednesdays from 8 to 10. Each and every Wednesday, 718-554-8598 is that number in the studio. I got to big up to Sister Angie, the producer of this show, and, and she's doing a wonderful job, right? And again, we'll keep adding special guests, having special conversations, right? Of course, now I'll get the Rastafari vibe. Of course, now I'll get some 12 Tribe Orthodox selection, right? Um, of course, you're going to get an earful of conversation. That's what you get each and every Wednesday when you lock in. A Rasta show. Call it alive. Call it alive. I think we lost that one, but it's okay. Brother Deuce. How do I enjoy the show tonight, brother? Beautiful, man. Beautiful. Boy, I say, believe me. It's, it, it, it's a twin is like a parrot. <laughs> you talk about talk. You will talk till all next week. I could tell you. I <laughs> a joke to him. I know that. <laughs> <laughs> but we, we give thanks that you're able to invite us. And who has spread the message? Why the message is about Christ, you know, in his glory. Anyone that think it's not that, you know I mean? If you don't love God, something wrong. Rastafari. Sunday nights here at Soundchat Radio, 8 to 10. The Rastas are in the building. So make sure the item is listening and watching as well on SoundchatRadio.com. So again, um, we sign off, getting ready for the uh, next show to come up. But again, I, I had fun, man. I, I, I learned so much tonight. We talk about it off here. Thank you guys so much for locking in. Soundchat Radio in your ears.